Hi everyone. I actually wasn't planning on doing a video today. Um, my baby's not feeling too well, but there was some like really good um, views of some of these ram's horn eggs um, at different stages of development. So I wanted to get that on camera. Um, and so I'll just go ahead and do a quick video on the second tank that um, I plan to spotlight on this channel. Um, this tank is going to have some cherry shrimp in it. Um, eventually, I just want to make sure that it's nice and cycled before I move any over. And um, so I'm going to put the camera up there. I have this ram's horn in there. And then this one. And these two are the um, only adults that have been in there and this tank has had these ram's horns in it for um, about a week and a half now um, originally I had some ghost shrimp in there but um, I decided to go ahead and switch over to all cherry shrimp and um, so I just fed off the ghost shrimp to my turtle but yeah so these two snails have laid quite a bit of eggs in this past week and a half um, and so I really want I had moved them over they were in the original um, ram's horn tank which I had in my last video and I moved them over here so I could have a more accurate so I could have more accurate dates for you guys um, um, this tank also has a DIY biological filter in it and I have some shells I collected from um, the beach here in North Carolina. I have a sand dollar that was also from one of the beaches here. It's actually from Sand Dollar Island. Um, and then I just have some designs and um, some tank decorations in there from, tank, from PetSmart. And I have um, a tank heater which is automatically set at um, 78 degrees. That sound is my daughter playing with a toy. Here you go. Well, I think she's done with it now. And I'm trying to give it back to her. Um, okay, so these eggs here, you can see there's three clutches here. There's some of the newer laid eggs where you can't really see much development yet um these eggs here you can see a lot of development um these you can see just a little bit of development if i can get the camera i might have to like actually focus somewhere else and then you kind of look down here and see See this camera? Okay, there we go. So you can see both of those. The bottom one here is um, less developed, obviously, than this one, which they'll be hatching soon. There's some more up here that are pretty well developed. So these ones were laid like in the first days. So they'll all be hatching soon. So that's pretty on par from what I found that it could take like you know about two weeks for the eggs to hatch so it's been a week and a half and there's some other oh there's some and actually I don't know if you can see hmm no well, this camera's not getting a good picture of it, but I will actually post a picture. I'll get a good picture, and I'll post it on my Instagram. Um, it's the same handle, Shy Halo, S-H-Y-H-A-L-O. I'll get a better picture of these eggs. Um, those There's actually some that have already hatched, and I wish I could get a better picture in this video. But um, So there is actually probably some babies in here. Um, you can't really see the babies when they first hatch and probably for the first week or so. Um, well, actually, well, at least I haven't been able to really see them. 
um, because I see that some have hatched out of that, but I don't see any eggs. I mean, I don't see any babies, but I know in my other tank, um, I saw that some had hatched and it was like a week or two before I was actually noticing, um, babies all over the tank. So, um, I'm going to keep a really close eye because I want to be able to give you guys some good, um, accurate, an accurate timeline. So, um, again, this is going to, I guess I'll call this ram's horn and cherry tank the other one is called ram's horn i have labeled as ram's horn tank but this is another five gallon tank so i just need to differentiate the names um maybe i'll call it that or for now i'll call it that for this video at least um you have another name you think i should call it suggest so that down below um and maybe I'll have a new name for it next time we we view this tank. Um, the next tank we'll be viewing in the next video is going to be this tank over here. And that's my Mexican tank. <laughs> we'll go through that more later, um, why it's called that. But um, we're going to go hang out with this little one. Say bye, Alicia. She's like, I want to take a nap. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, it's been great. Um, any comments, questions, concerns, or suggestions, leave them down below. Thanks.